Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you a big baby girl clothing haul um, and this is a collective haul of things that I've bought from Asda, from H&M and from Primark. Um, so some of it are bits that I've got, some are bits that Jack has got and some are bits that have been given to us. So I'm going to crack straight on, I'm going to try and include close-ups of different pieces of clothing as well so you can see the patterns and the prints properly um, and I'm also going to link anything I can link down below and leave prices for you as well. So do check out the down bar if you see anything that you like. So I'm just going to get straight into it and I'm going to start with all the things we got from Asda. So I find that the Asda baby stuff is actually really good, they have some really cute things in there. So whenever I go in to buy food, I'm always so tempted to buy half of the baby oil. I have to try resist sometimes, but I have picked up a few bits, sort of as and when we've been in there. The first being this little romper. It is so cute. It's got elephant print on it, and then it's got like a white top with blue polka dots. Um, and I think it's very clearly girly. Um, and I've said in a previous video that I don't want to dress her in just all pink um so i did want to get some other colors thrown into her wardrobe as well so she's not just wearing pink all the time because a lot of people will just buy you pink clothes if you're having a girl um so yeah i thought this was really cute i got it in first size just because it is very hot at the moment and um, so i don't know sort of how often she'll be wearing proper full-on outfits um just because we have had a heat wave recently and i don't know if that's going to continue throughout summer but it's been like 30 degrees so i thought this is just a nice outfit that'll keep her nice and cool um just for those first few weeks while she's still small next i have a little tiny pair of jeggings um i just couldn't resist really who doesn't love a pair of jeggings um, so i got her a pair of jeggings and then i thought well i'll get her a t-shirt to go with it as well and the t-shirt was only two pounds um so it's just this t-shirt here and on it it says lovely just like my mummy because i'm lovely aren't i <laughs> don't worry i'm not that big-headed but i just thought it's a cute little outfit very cheap i think the top was two pound and i'm pretty sure the jeggings were four pounds but like i said i will double check all prices and everything and leave them down below Next, and this outfit I absolutely adore. I just love it. I, I don't know what drew me to it, but I just love it. So it's black and white all over, and then it's got these hints of yellow as well. So there's some little yellow buttons on the leggings, and then there's a yellow bow across here. These are love hearts, and then you've got the stripes and the love heart pockets. And I just thought it was adorable. Um, this one's 0 to 3, so hopefully it'll last her a little bit longer than the first size stuff. Um, I'm so tempted to go back and get it also in <laughs> 3 to 6 months as well, so it lasts her even longer. But I don't know, I just thought it was adorable. And they've got some other sets in like the same patterns um, and same colours as this and I really like it. It is obviously very girly, but it's not like in your face pink, like I said. And yeah, I just think it's so cute. And I think this set was six pounds as well. So again, it's really affordable. I love Asda for baby stuff. It's always so cheap, but really pretty. And the last bit from Asda that I am including in this haul, we've got a lot more stuff that was bought for us, but I'm just trying to limit how long the video is. So the next thing I'm going to include is just this little blue dress here. And I thought this is such a cute little summer dress. I got it in 0-3 because obviously she'll be 0-3 throughout the whole of summer. Um, and it's just so adorable. It's got like the pleats along the bottom. It's got this sort of um, floral embroidery on it as well. And I just thought it was adorable, really. Jack's favourite colour is blue, so I thought, well, he should like this as well. Um, so yeah, this is just a cute little summer dress that will last for her throughout summer. Okay, so now I'm moving on to the few bits that I got from H&M. I didn't get loads from H&M, um, but one of the things I got were these little pair of shorts, which I just couldn't resist. She doesn't have any shorts, and... I don't know obviously how long her legs are going to be so these might end up looking a bit more like ankle swingers um, but I thought because it is summer and it is hot I can put her in a vest and just chuck a pair of shorts on over the top so she'll look a bit more dressed but she's not like covered from head to toe in clothing um, so these are just pink with some stripes and I'm pretty sure these were like £2.50 or something so really cheap and they're like a nice sort of cotton feel material nice and lightweight so they should keep her cool 
um, but obviously not keep her too cool that she gets cold. So I just thought these were really good because we don't have any shorts for her. Um, we've got lots of dresses and play suits um, and sleep suits and vests and things. So this is her one and only pair of shorts. I also couldn't resist this little white embroidered dress and it's got the um, it's got the sewn in sort of vest as well so you can do that up over the nappy but I just thought this was so cute I don't we've got a few things going on over summer I think so um, I thought this would be nice something for her to wear when she goes out and about and meets people although I'm hoping everyone will think she's cute no matter what she's wearing I just thought she'd look extra cute wearing something like this and it's just so adorable um, it's got the embroidered flowers along the bottom and on the sleeves as well and I just thought it was so sweet I wish it came in like adult size <laughs> the other couple of bits I got from H&M are like accessories so I went there and I got her some hair bows. I wasn't gonna, I thought, oh, she doesn't need bows for her hair, but I couldn't resist in the end. <laughs> I got one that's, this is white with pink patterns on, there's one that's yellow, and then there's one that has um, sort of blue, pink, purple, and yellow butterflies on, and I will insert close-ups of these so you can see them properly. Um, but I just got a few of these as well so she can also wear them with some of the stuff that she got bought that's more gender neutral um, just in case she doesn't have a lot of hair or you know just so people don't mistake her for a boy not that it matters but plus I just think they're really cute and I'd like to wear bows in my hair all the time if I was a baby so I'm sure my baby will want to do the same not that she's got much choice in the matter and then the last bit from H&M was this set and it's a pair of little sort of ballet pumps and also another um, hair accessory this just has flowers going all the way around and I thought that would be really nice with like the white embroidered dress or with some of the other dresses that um, my nan, so her great nan will have bought her as well she's got some nice really pretty summer dresses I don't know we've got at least one wedding that we're going to so I thought this would be really nice for her to wear with one of those dresses as well the shoes are really soft as well, um, obviously she's not going to be walking around in them because she's still going to be a baby that's not able to walk, but they're nice and soft so they shouldn't make her feet feel too rigid, um, they're kind of like a cross between socks and shoes I would say. And finally I have some stuff that we bought from Primark, although this is actually things that Jack has bought for the baby from Primark. So, so the first things he bought were these two pack of tops. So. There's a pink top on the front with like a blue butterfly um, which is really pretty and it says little butterfly on it and then on the back there's this white top that's got all the different patterned butterflies on it as well um, and he also picked up the <laughs> matching leggings so I think I'll mix and match them when I actually dress her so she'll wear like the pink leggings with that top and then the patterned leggings with that top. Well that's how I've instructed Jack to dress her, whether that's how he dresses her when he gets her dressed is another matter entirely but I thought these were really cute as well and have I left the prices on here? The tops were £3.50 and the leggings were £3 so it's £6.50 for two pairs of leggings and two tops all together. And finally is a little outfit that Jack originally bought her to wear to his friend's wedding. Although we have also been bought some really lovely dresses from my nan. So we're not too sure what we're going to dress her in for the wedding now. Um, but this was originally bought for her to wear to his friend's wedding. And he picked it all by himself. So it's this little pink summer dress. And it's really cute. It's got multicoloured ice cream cones all over it. And it's really lightweight. Really adorable. And I just think she'd look really cute in this. And then he also picked her up some little sandals and these are really cute as well. There's kind of, they're kind of um, denim effect sandals and they've just got the little bows on the front as well. And they're so teeny tiny, like they just fit in your hand. I don't understand how one person can be so small. But yeah, these are the little sandals as well that he bought to go with the dress. So actually I think I whizzed through that all quite quickly, I don't think this video has gone on for too long, which is good. Um, sorry about the lighting and if my camera goes in and out of focus at all. The light is really bad outside today, it's really grey and like muggy, um, so I'm kind of using a cross between natural light and the light in here, but for some reason when I use like 
indoor lighting my camera struggles to focus um so anywho rambling now thank you for watching this video like i said anything that i can link i will have linked down below and i've tried to leave prices for everything as well so if there's anything that sort of took your fancy or if you know someone that's having a baby and you think yeah i want to get that for them then you can go find it down below obviously the primark stuff i can't link to but i've tried to leave prices so if you enjoy these kind of videos then please do give me a big thumbs up so I know that you do enjoy them. Leave your comments down below. I do try to read and reply to them all but keep in mind that I am very heavily pregnant and I could be having a baby any minute so replies might sometimes be a bit delayed but I will try and get back to everyone at some point. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button as well so you don't miss out on my future videos and I will see you all in my next one. Bye!